Hi and welcome once again to another video of SpaceX updates. Even though there isn't much testing going on in the last few days at Starbase, SpaceX is working towards the full static fire of Booster 7 in the first orbital test flight. Today's road closure has been cancelled. At the build site, Booster 7 is still inside the Megabay undergoing inner Raptor installation. At the launch site, last night, crews installed hydraulic pistons on the chopstick arms. These are the last bits of hardware they would want to install before attempting to catch the booster. I think they are definitely trying to catch the booster on the first attempt. We have seen all the hints. In the recent FCC filing, SpaceX mentioned the possible attempt to catch the booster. Crews have been working ever so hard on the shock absorption mechanism on the booster catching arms. Well, it may sound exaggerated to say that SpaceX is confident to achieve all these targets on the first attempt, but SpaceX has never been afraid of trying and failing. That is Elon Musk's principle of making the impossible become a reality. NASA's preparation of SLS's rollout to the launch pad is moving ahead of the earlier planned schedule. The moon rocket will be rolled out to the launch pad tomorrow using the crawler transporter 2. The giant crawler transporter is already in place under the mobile launcher inside the vehicle assembly building at Kennedy Space Center. NASA's Artemis 1 mission to the moon is scheduled for August 29th liftoff. Are you guys excited for this launch too? Comment down below. That is it for now. See you in the next video.